Hello everybody and welcome back to the Chateau. Yesterday I was off uh, jet washing the terrace at the bar, ready to get that open for Easter. Uh, so today I definitely, definitely have to get on in this beautiful spring sunshine with something in the garden because I need this garden to dry out because I need to get fairly heavy equipment in and not destroy the garden with it to be able to deal with that massive tree that's fallen over. So I need to get all the grass down so the ground underneath can dry out properly and I need to get rid of something that's been here for a long time which has just got to go. That's right, this massive, massive tree will be a huge problem because it is obviously not small, but it's mostly going to be a big problem because it's come up with the entire bank. So this isn't done very carefully. This can actually just flip right back up when you're cutting it and um, yeah, that's extremely dangerous. So I'm gonna have to get some machinery and I think we're gonna get a digger in and just get as much of this root ball in the bank gone before we start chopping it up. However, all the small stuff at the end, which isn't much weight, can start coming off once I've got the ground dry enough to get the cars in, trailers in and all the stuff that's needed. So, that's a priority. Look at that. First cut completed. And it really is, oh, I don't know what, it's so fulfilling, something so simple, cutting the grass for the first time, making it look tidy. I've obviously got some bits and pieces which are left in the garden. They're drying out now and they can get washed and put away. And I can see all the way to the back. So I will be able to deal with all of this wood and all the rest of it. Now for anybody that's saying, oh, why did you do that? The dandelions are out and the bees. There's plenty of other places which I don't need at the moment where I've left the dandelions. This garden, unfortunately, I need to get heavy machinery in it to deal with the tree and to get everything looking good. And for that to happen, because it's extremely waterlogged, I need the grass down so the ground can start drying. Now, obviously I need this top corner, all the rest of it. It's nice with the spring sounds to get stuff sorted out. I'm gonna make a start on removing the old peacock pen. I think I can't remove the whole thing today. If I take this chicken wire off this side, Take the posts out, at least I'll be able to get that big mower in there, clean the area and it'll make it much easier to do the rest. Let's see how far I can get. Right, I think. Oh, really? Oh, yes. It makes short work of that, doesn't it? And like I said, getting 
all of this stuff down so it can just be cut with a normal mower on a regular basis will mean ultimately that the grass will be what grows back. Uh, you know, might put grass seed down after a scarify, it, but being able to keep it clear easily is the aim. And that is the aim with a chateau. The least amount of work possible. And then it's doable to maintain. It's just not when it's intricate. Uh, let's get the last of this out. It's because it's all, while I'm on a roll, let's get some more of this stuff out. Because at the moment, it all feels a little bit weird. Because at the moment, it all feels a little bit weird because I'm just taking stuff down, clearing stuff out, removing stuff, which was a huge part of my life for quite a few years. So, um, not a bad thing, I guess. However, it does feel a little bit odd. But I'm not gonna have peacocks again. I'm not gonna have anything for this area, so this needs to be done. And I wanna get it clear. looking too shabby. I'm going to have to do something about the actual pen. More importantly, we've got something about that gate. Otherwise, it's just a random gate to nowhere. <clears throat> That's actually one of the original gates from the very front of the driveway down on the main road. Uh, and rather unfortunately, this one is the only one of the two which still exists. The other one was cut up into pieces to make fencing for somewhere else. Not by me, obviously. Um, so, if I can get that down, and I can finish clearing up, I can worry about this. However, that gate is extremely heavy, and I am not going to manage that by myself. And uh, with the fact that I'm probably going to have to have a digger in to deal with that root ball and the bank, uh, do you know what? There is no point in hurting myself trying to manhandle that when I can use a piece of equipment to do it quite easily in the future. And I've done a decent little clear up there. I can actually get a normal mower in there to keep that down now. So there it is, success. Done the whole of the back garden. Cleared this little path through here now. Obviously I need to be getting to some of this stuff, clearing out the gardening shed. This lot all needs doing yet. We drag stuff out to dry in the sun down there. Everything is all, uh, it's all cut down. I mean, it's amazing how good you feel when it all looks like a bit better. I've gone right back into the hedge behind all the wood. I can get to all the wood to chop up. And then of course, this is all down. I'm gonna work out what to do with the pen but certainly I, uh, I'm going to take that down while I can get the trailer in the back garden when this is all dried out a little bit. I definitely need help for that old gate and of course then I can go into this corner because that's all wood that needs to be stacked and I'm clearing out my little forest at the moment which is where the wood's going to live and there's plenty of it. Not a bad day's work. I think I've done pretty well today. It might be Enough for today. What do you think? <laughs>